these products contain bits or even <laughs> few drops or plenty drops of hydroquinone okay now hydroquinone like i always say is not a bad ingredient it is only bad when you girls are abusing it okay she's a mona lisa everyone's lining up to see her there must be something bad Mm -mm -mm. I am back like I never left. What's good? What's good? What's popping? Lovers, how are you all doing? How are you guys doing? It's been a whole month or even more than a month since I actually did any content on my channel, guys. Yes, yeah, slap me, enjoy me, chook me, knife, pierce me, whatever you want to do, you are free. Today's video, we're going to be talking about something different. We're going to be doing a review on Dermalee's lotion, which is supposed to be called a toner, girl. That's not a lotion. Aren't you saying? We're gonna be doing a review on that product in today's video. So if you want to know what that toner is about or lotion like they call it, please endeavor to watch to the very end. Because if you do not watch to the very end and come to my comment section, we are gonna drop this drink. With that said, let's jump right in into this video. Yes, girl, I know you guys will be like blue, you're looking dark, you're looking this, you're looking this. Guys, I'm stressed, my skin is looking horrible, and I'm even horrified by the way my skin is looking right now. But I'm not really bothered, you know period because i'm gonna get my skin back because i'm the skincare guru trust me you know what i mean y'all be like <laughs> what products are you using girl okay can you tell us okay but let's get into the reason why y'all clicked on this video real quick anyway yeah today we're gonna be talking about dermally lotion this is supposed to be called a toner not a lotion okay because this is that tonerish ish ish consistency it doesn't have anything like oil or anything like Creamy consistency. I mean, a lotion is supposed to be a consistency of creams, okay? That's what I know. I don't know about y'all. This is supposed to be a bleachy body lotion, but girl, I'm gonna call this a bleaching body and face toner, okay? Because that's what that's what the vibe of this thing gets to me, okay? Now, I'm gonna tell you what I think about this toner. I'm gonna give you guys my 100% honest reviews about this toner right here or lotion, girl. That thing is very, very hard for me to actually call it a lotion because I'm used to the... You know, lotion type of consistency, not waterish. This is so liquidy, girl, and it brings foam. So I don't even know what this is. Now I'm gonna tell you guys about my thought about these products and also tell you guys the pros, the cons, and what I feel like this product actually does and what I think you guys should, you know, avoid, you know, while using this product, okay? Now, number one thing we're gonna be talking about is the cons, okay? The conditions, the terms and conditions applies. We're gonna be talking about what you get when you use this product. People who shouldn't use this product. Now, number one on my list is if you have sensitive skin, tend to run away just pack your bags and run from this product because if you really have a sensitive skin you you are going to buy dermalis like for real for real you're buying dermalis okay okay i see <laughs> i'm not gonna tell you what's gonna happen to you when you buy it but you know what this product is really hard like i called it bleaching toner not Play, play toner. It is called a bleaching toner for a reason. So if you have like skin problematic areas on your skin and you need a strong product and you have a very tough skin, this product can actually work perfectly for you. But people who have soft and tender and very sensitive skin, you might want to run away from this, okay? And if you have dark spots, this actually helps in clearing your dark spot, fading it off in no time. Guys, I'm not even kidding you. Like if you consistently use this toner, it will fade off your dark spot. But then so many people have been bringing bad reviews about these toners it was fast selling at some point but at some point my girl stopped selling fast on the market everybody stopped talking about Germany's body lotion or toner in my own word okay number one thing i always notice about the toner is that it gives you that burning hot sensation if you are that person that has like medium to very sensitive skin then this would actually make your skin huh you it will look like you have just a plant and seed on your face Number one thing about it is that when you use it on your skin, you get to feel that burning hot sensation on your face. It's gonna stop, don't get me wrong. I know a lot of you guys are scared for that one, but it's gonna stop after a while, it will calm down. Now, my best way to using this toner is when you apply it on your face, leave it there for 30 minutes. If you can bear hot burning sensation, please rinse it off after 30 minutes. If you have left it there and then let it sit there for 30 minutes and then rinse it out. Don't let this sit on your face to the next tip. And then another thing I always recommend when using this toner is use it only at night guys this is a bleaching toner it's not something that you should be using daytime when you wake up in the morning and you're slathering this on your face and you're going underneath the sun girl 
don't do it okay just get the toner use it only at night guys I'm saying it 10 times because some people's ear they put something inside it doesn't hear in the night so i have to tell you like 100 times so you get my these products contain bits or even <laughs> few drops or plenty drops of hydroquinone okay? now hydroquinone like i always say is not a bad ingredient it is only bad when you girls are abusing it okay you know those girls those from mixing aunties that always like to abuse teens that's when it's bad like two percent one percent one percent of hydroquinone is not bad for your skin but when you start abusing it and using like 10 100 percent then uh, uh, i don't want to say it anyway just be careful and then another thing i noticed about these toner is that it has 100 percent alcoholic net so if you have a dry skin this will dry your skin even further like really further like far away from your house like far away from your street like to another state that is how drying your skin is going to be so if you're going to use this toner please my girl my sister my brother everybody that's trying to get it please make sure that you put that in the back of your mind this toner dries out even an oily person's skin not to talk more of a person that has a dry skin all right tag you need to be careful girl because uh, just be careful period so this toner you're gonna use it make sure you have a very moisturizing lotion to back it up that is the reason why i do not recommend that when you use the toner you let it sit on your face like a normal toner because this is not even normal this is not even close to normal there's nothing normal about this thing it's so strong you can perceive the strong 100 percent rubbing alcohol embedded in this product okay so if you're gonna use it make sure you have a very moisturizing face cream or body lotion on hand just before you start using this thing because girl <laughs> when, when when i say something always listen to your system just don't be stubborn just listen this is going to dry out it will rip you off of your natural oil on your skin okay fine it helps to get rid of too many oils on your skin you know a lot of people are always complaining about oils like some people who have oily skin always complaining oh my skin is so oily blue what should i do about it it's actually going to help with the oil but if you use it too much girl i don't know i don't just know even you that's oily you're gonna be dry so you that's dry you're gonna be drier oh see pun intended this actually is a toner and has you know abilities of you know cleansing your skin this is a very deep cleanser to me i feel like it's a cleanser and a toner in one bottle so when you're cleaning your skin it cleans it like cleans it's legit like when you look at the cotton pad you're seeing so many dirt so many things on the pad you're like god is this on my face really normally are you trying to pull my yash i, I bath every day like I shower do you get what i mean so anyway that is what this cleanser actually does it cleanses your skin opens your pores to accepting your products and this is just to treat stubborn you know spots like the stubborn spots i've been battling with now in delta state i got this because i have so many dark spots that i'm trying to fade off anyway yeah this actually i got it because of those stubborn dark spot and as soon as i noticed that the spots are beginning to fade off i stopped the use of this because guys the side effects about these toner is that when you're using it and you've got into the desired shade because it will bleach your skin guys i'm not gonna lie a dark person using this to come and clear dark spots because they are fighting acne and this cannot try it don't try me don't try me malo wow i got walk we fight so if you're dark in complexion please run away from this even bother is what did i call it from this? bleaching it will bleach you hmm. and what's price not gonna bleach in a very unifying way it's gonna bleach in a very coke and fatter ish way don't play with you though. don't play with me on my child this is actually going to make your skin very fair in complexion if you are using it too much like you're using it you've gone down one bottle two bottles three bottles are down on your case and you're still using it sister have the fear of god this is something you use in taking care of stubborn spots like dark spots on your face that would not go for people who have tough skin that is hard for products to, you know penetrate their skin this is actually a product for you to go for don't use it for a very long period don't turn this to your go-to toner on a daily basis once you have gotten your desired shade if you're trying to use this to whiten or lighten your skin please discontinue the use once you've used it in fading off the dark spot if that is what you're looking for please discontinue the use do not use this lotion or toner for a very long period of time okay because you you will not like it it tends to give you that reddish um redness on your face those reddish under eye reddish baby mouth i don't know what to call this place i think there's something they call it actually you don't want to use this for too long and you don't want to use this and go underneath the sun so the best time to use this is in the, in the night or in the evening this is when it is preferable for me personally i recommend 
recommend that you use this in the night. So this is actually cool, but then you need to be careful with it, okay? It has antioxidant properties, okay? It has other benefits that you can actually use this thing for, but other than that, please do not go overboard. Study the ingredients to know what is in the bottle so that when you're buying your face cream, you know what to buy. You don't buy the same ingredient that is in this thing on your face cream. Otherwise, you end up with a very scary sensation. Like the sensation on your skin is going to look like somebody poured you acid, like your skin is about to burn. So, so you need to be careful. Sensitive aunties, please run away from this. Don't even try it. Don't, don't dare me. I can see you from here. If you are interested in Dormelis lotion, guys, please holler at your girl at blue underscore skincare underscore. It is very much available for purchasing. And you know, yeah, it's very affordable for you guys if you want to try that toner, okay? And yeah, that's what I wanted to share with you guys about the Dermalis toner. And you know, I've told you guys the cons and how to use it and you know, what you should be looking out for when you're purchasing it and making sure that you are not purchasing the fake. It has a seal container. I opened mine, that's why you can't see the toner um, seal on it. So be careful when you're purchasing it because the adulterated one is everywhere in the market. Trust me guys, you want to be careful and you want to stay safe. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share and I'll see you guys in another amazing amazing content bye